So, um, there's really not much to say about this. So why'd you pick it then? <laughs> <laughs> Bart doesn't want to see it anymore. <laughs> shit like this for? I, I, I saw think, it. I see you see what? it. Oh. Is this Bart another like a ninja was raped or some shit? Fancy used to yourself for all Ryan Day. Oh, no. Dude, if a ninja gets raped though, that's impressive. That's on scene. I'm curious about the story behind this one. You have to, take the really off. You have to sneak around. Get an exclusive on that. <laughs> a grandma's dying wish. Mm. I mean, just imagine a grandma's dying wish was to have a penis put on her tombstone. <laughs> nice. Is that India? That's incredible. That's a realistic no, penis. Right. Suddenly you're into it, huh? <laughs> Is it her husband's penis? I shared this. That's a big ass that, dick. Dude, if, that's, if, if so, that's why she died. They got the whole, <laughs> they got the whole bottom thing too, that's, that's crazy. Yeah. sack. Yeah, the sack is made of stone. It's huge. That looks modeled after some guy's actual dick. It's a great yeah, sack. Yeah, that guy's got a chubster for sure. Someone's gonna get sued. <laughs> I mean, for Katarina, that's that's literally this uh, grandma's name. She is 99 years old. She decided to leave a very, quote, distinctive mark on the world mm. that will leave people remembering her for years to come. Wonder, was that her, like, wish before she was dying? Because if it's her dying wish as she's dying, they, you know, Dying people kind of say the crazy shit, right? Yeah, sure. <laughs> She's got like dementia. <laughs> just... Still her oh, though. I them for the penis. <laughs> <laughs> and I wonder if she's buried upright so the lady. dick is fucking on top of her head. Dude, no, if she's buried where the dick is coming like from the pelvis. <laughs> oh yeah. yeah. That's, right, that's, that's right. sick. That's how you do it. Yeah, that's amazing. Flat. That's going up. And so then the thing is she dying. wanted a hard dick too. She didn't want a dangly dick. What, she was gonna get like the Fuddruckers blow up things and shit like that? that? Yeah, so it's yeah, yeah, constantly yeah, malleable? Cool. I'm into that. Yeah, that's that would be kind of tight. So it was her dying wish, which idea. means that, uh, you know, there's no fact checking on whether or not she was wishing for this a long time before her death. It was a dying wish thing. Yeah, do you think it was like one of those planned ones, like, when I die? Like it's in paper? like Yeah, like, in her will. Yeah. Like, I want the hard dick. Or was it like, like, her fucking last breath was like, <laughs> did, did you just say the same thing but whisper it? Yeah, like dying, dying. But not but verbally, not in, not in like writing. Got it, got it, got it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah. One is like fucking, like with the fucking quilt, like a quilt fucking, the the, the, the feather pen shit. Notarized. Yeah, yeah and it's like. Or, or was it broken up in pieces? Where she's like, I want a hard, uh, and they're like, clear. Oh, dick! <laughs> yeah. Or, we gotta put it together! We gotta put the whole sentence together! Hard, I want a hard dick. dick! Hard dick, that's it. Yeah. Or is it like, maybe like, you know, God forbid, when the time comes, Nikki's grandma, Nikki's Filipino grandma, whispers in my ear, and she's like saying some shit, and I'm like, fuck, I really can't. <laughs> <laughs> I'm like, Pretty sure it's the garlic, but. I, I think she wants a big hard dick statue over her grave. I don't know. I, I think that's what she said? I'm the only one who heard it. I don't know. You Couldn't make it up. You yeah. weren't there. Yeah. I don't know. How would you know? That's what we gotta do. What if oh, her last yeah. words was putang in a ball? That's what you're getting on your tombstone. Okay. What's Sounds that mean? Sounds like a real joke. By the way, she's What's that mean? Lady's Mexican, by the way. Fuck you, bitch, or something, there. right? Oh, okay. no, do more Indian accents, I think. Okay. okay. Okay, so weighing almost 600 pounds, the massive stone member Whoa. has been 600. called. What's That's inside of it? Recognition of her love and joy for life. Katarina's oh. grandson, Alvaro Mota Limon. I don't know why I said Mota. Mota. Uh, oh, wait, they're Hispanic? Yeah, said, said his grandma liked calling her family verga, which is a Mexican slang word most yes. accurately translated to cock yeah. in English. Uh, they called her it. grandma grandma dick? She grandma called everyone Verga. she called everyone dick. Yeah, she she liked calling her family verga. Oh hey dick. <laughs> oh that's cool. Yeah. That's dope. Alright. So like she kinda has that vibe. It's a very, very uh fun uh yeah. slang that's like vamos a la verga. Yeah. It's like we all go to the cock or whatever, but everybody in Mexico loves that saying. I say it all the time when I'm in Mexico, they love it. I think it's inappropriate. But They're like better guys. Yeah. Vamonos a la verga. If you if you know what I'm talking about in the comments, just what go ahead and mean? write that in English. Going to the cock room? Yeah, like vamonos, like let's all go to the penis. Vamonos a la verga. When you go visit your uh, in-laws. Vamonos a la verga. Not in my verga. Vamonos a la verga. Vamonos in my verga. Vamonos a la verga. I made it all Italian too. Vamonos a la verga. That's good. Verga. What's the, when do, what are the appropriate uses for that? It's one of those things that's either an insult or a compliment. You know when you call somebody a motherfucker? Oh. 
Say what's up, motherfucker. Or you motherfucker. It's it's kind of like that in the sense of saying verga. Oh, exit in there. Like what? There's like some sort of like directional like, verb. Like what the hell does that mean? Comes next? It go. depends though, because if I'm- That's just a phrase, but verga is a, is a oh. term in and of itself. It depends on the who though, because if I'm a person who doesn't have very many friends, and I hear you refer to Ryan as a cock, I'm like, oh, he probably hates this guy. <laughs> <laughs> it didn't used to always be like this, man. Why are they being- Wait, sounds like they're bullying each other. They're beefing. Yeah, they're definitely beefing with yeah, each other. You yeah, can see it. The way he said off camera. Almost Sofia beef. Vergara. You can, <laughs> you can tell they have definite oh, beef so because I don't have any friends to compare this to, and uh, real friendships shouldn't have that kind of relationship. <laughs> just being very matter of fact. Uh, just, just, so, just wondering. So, does she die and she has the tombstone, or does she make the tombstone before she dies? Oh, damn! She, uh, she had to make it herself. Pharaoh. She, she crafted it herself. Uh, she crafted it herself. She it just, killed her. <laughs> <laughs> it crushed her. And it killed her eventually. <laughs> it worked. I mean, I don't think she uh, made it herself. Okay. Just to clarify. Mm. But, uh, and, and we'll just assume that she's totally dead already and it oh. just happened. We'll just assume. Okay. Her, her grandson, Alvaro, uh, says that when she was throwing the word at her family, she meant it to mean that they were people of integrity. Courage, passion, and at the same time, love and joy. That's what that That's, that's what a hard dick I means? I think so. Wow. Hey, so. women love it. They do. <laughs> they love it. Do. It's integrity. It's courage. I'm telling people this all the time. They don't really get it. Yeah. This story helps with that. I thought middle school boys like dick the most, but now I realize it's Mexican grandmas. Mm -hmm. Mexican grandmas love. Yeah, she, this uh, she did the entire census for the, for the entire Mexican grandma population out mm. there. You guys wouldn't want interesting things on your tombstones. A giant verga. Maybe. A verga. I've that's seen, expensive. I've seen baking recipes on Tombstone. Oh, that's nice. Baking recipes? Yeah, like people will have their own like dish and they'll wow. have the recipe engraved on their tombstone. What? You know what doesn't that's look crazy. cool but is cool? The QR codes that you've been seeing yeah. on Tombstones. Mm -hmm. That's kind of whack, wow. isn't it? Yeah, it's kind of whack. whack. But the idea of being able to like look it up and then like see that person's like life in different ways or whatever they that's have. That's kind of tight. Mm -hmm. <laughs> 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 Change of heart. Right now. <laughs> what if the QR code went straight to JK News? We. <laughs> That's a good way to. Mark that would be a nightmare. Question. Very, very, very important. Yeah, which video? Would you fuck your mom or your dad. Probably that one. Probably <laughs> that. We're one. gonna win a streaming for. Definitely gonna win. We're up for it. Did you guys submit? We submitted, right? It's looking okay. good. Yeah, it's looking really good. I hope we win that one. It's looking really good. Would you? Would you guys want to be buried at a graveyard? Like, like a normal person? Oh yeah, man. Rose Hills, all the way. Oh. You got family there? Easy E. What? You have family there? Is that why? Like, I, I don't think I do. <laughs> so you're I just gonna be there by yourself? I just think the idea is cool. Oh. I think I want to be buried, but then like not this way, the other way, and on top of Michael Jackson. <laughs> Face down? That's really good. What Face down. Fuck? So Michael Jackson is down here, I'm gonna buy the space up there, yeah. and I'm gonna go, go in front of him. <laughs> you're gonna buy the vertical spot? Yeah. And then they're gonna, but they have to place you like... In Face front of him. Yeah, so then I can finally meet him. Just 69. Why would you do that to Michael? <laughs> You know you should get the body of a 13 year old boy and put it on top That's of that. That's true. Duh. That's true. That's what he was Duh. like. No, because they like, because he wants to hang out. It's <laughs> a little too old. <laughs> it's because they want to hang out, guys. I wanted to do a, the QR code thing, but when um, when people look it up, it's like me asking people to solve my murder. <laughs> oh, shit. Oh, that's it's pretty like, good. You've just accessed all the clues to my death. Please help solve this murder. Wow. wow. That's, then I really I just died rest. of cancer. <laughs> I can't rest. So, uh, and then, Katarina, yeah, known as Doña Cata, grew up in poverty and was not able to go to school as a child, but nonetheless became an important person in this area. Uh, her grandson even became mayor of the town for a period of time, saying his grandma taught her family that they could be anything they wanted and inspired them to get education and school. Wow. Hey, real talk, wow. probably a weird time to bring this up, but I saw a fucking ghost last night. I'm not Where? Sure. Where? In, my, in my hotel room in the, at the bike. No fucking way. Really? Not fucking kidding. Wow. Not fucking kidding. It was so crazy. Oh, man. I woke up at like probably five in the morning. And I'm just like, you know, on my side or whatever, and Nikki's next to me. And I roll over and I look up and there's just a fucking dude standing over our bed. What is he doing? He's just standing there staring down. But what like, it's a complete he's silhouette. He, he's a, he's, he's Haitian, bro. I don't fucking know. <laughs> <laughs> he's being real. Yeah. Yeah, I'm, <laughs> I'm, just, I'm just wondering if if spirits keep what their... His hair? I'm just, wor I'm just wondering... <laughs> just a silhouette. How many fingers does he have? Yeah. Yeah. A, a pure silhouette. I don't know if spirits keep their ethnic 
He was no, gaunt. No, I hope so. It was a silhouette. It, was a, it was a skinny dude standing over our bed. He was skinny, gaunt. Skinny. It was Definitely. a shadow, though. I don't know. See, he was skinny. <laughs> right. But yeah, it was. It was, dude. I'm telling you, like that's as sure that's as I'm sweet. sitting here, it was the shadow dude standing over our bed. There was like um this white lampshade behind. Um, like in the corner, that was covered, obstructed by him. Whoa. He was and blocking it. There was like moonlight coming in through the curtains. Translucening him? No, no translucent bullshit. It would look like some dude was in our so fucking- a regular room. guy standing there. The fucking dude over standing the there bed. over was our bed. Was he saying anything to you? No, not floating, just standing there staring down. And I couldn't even put it together because it's just so, it's just so weird. I wasn't scared Whoa. or anything. Here you go. Like, Holy <laughs> shit. No, I was like, what the, I was just so confused. I was like, like, what the fuck? fuck? This dude in my fucking room here? And then I went to, and then I, I sit up. He takes a step back, right? Fuck off. No, I'm not kidding. I, not, well, whatever it is, you like he, he was moved, he moved back. I don't know that he stepped or whatever, but he moves back. Like so he's closer back. to where the where the lampshade is, right? And then I'm like fucking confused. I like look over here and look back at he's gone. Whoa! <laughs> he's sleeping. The whole time. She's sleeping the whole oh, fucking time. Did you feel cold at all? No, no. Did you say switch rooms? Like that. You guys, we're gonna talk. Did you check your door lock? Was it locked? Was your ball yeah, sore? It was locked. Everything's normal. Yeah. No, I, was, I had cum all over my face and my in my tits. You're like, oh shit. <laughs> but I didn't think that that was very <laughs> weird. <laughs> did you decide to? Did you switch rooms? <laughs> no, weird. we're gonna talk to them. We'll see. What, what if you get happens. charged you for having an extra person? <laughs> Oh, he, he, he's the guy that takes the water from the sensor. You know, they charge the room because he took yeah. the water from the sensor. Yeah. <laughs> no, that's it was so fucking that's weird. Not, was that's that the first time ever? That was the first, well, uh, there, was a, there's a, there's a story where when I was a kid, um, we were coming in from Virginia to visit my grandma, and I was staying in my mom's old room in my grandma's home, and I wake up middle of the night, same kind of shit, like there's an alarm clock, like a glow from alarm clock, like orange glow. And there's just this dark figure standing over the bed. Same, same figure, shit. Same person. Same shit. But this one, it, it didn't feel like, th this one I felt nothing around, right? Felt nothing. But this one I felt like a weird sense of like it's all good. If the silhouette matched anybody in your prior history or family or anything, who would it be? Bro, nobody that I know. Can you see the face? No, fuck no. Just shadow. It's just shadow. Full shadow. So what, Did he have a driver's <laughs> license? <laughs> then, Any noises? The but then same, they have a no, no, strip? but the same shit, right? It's the same shit of like, of like you are confused, you look at it, and then you look away, and then it's completely gone. But it was Whoa. obstructing. It was like ob obstructing the light. That's, that's how, what happens on acid for me. That's how the that's how the commissioner feels about Batman. Yeah, <laughs> dude, you don't look. Oh, yeah. You shouldn't look away. Don't take your eyes off Batman. Yeah, Fuck. Because as soon as you look away, he's gone. Yeah, he's gone. You're like you fast back. How soon after you woke up, where you saw the fucking figure. It was like two minutes later. Did you? Oh, so you were kind of up. I was right? up and like, like I was like looking over here and I got a drink of water real quick because yeah. I had like water by the bed. And then you, you said, you said, off the cone. I went, excuse me, this guy gets water. And then I flip, I flip <laughs> over like, and that's when I see this dude in the room. And I'm like, what in the absolute fuck? Because it's Whoa. just, it's like as short as like anybody, you, you like light somebody and there's just, it's just that. It's, yeah. There's no translucent bullshit. He's not fucking, oh, I'm kind of floating. <laughs> it was just like a dude saying, well, the, you can't see what the clothes. What if he went away into like some sort of Secret tunnel in your. You probably went under under the into a secret tunnel. Yeah, but the, <laughs> there's, there's no clothes. It's like this fast, right? It's like boom, boom, gone. Boom, boom, gone. Like it just doesn't make sense. Boom, boom, boom. Let me hear you say whale, whale. whale.